Hi everyone, it's Matt from Greatness Every Day here and I want to talk about the fact that it's video number four of our 30 days of video challenge and it's also Sunday and on Sundays during this month I want to go ahead and give you a book review of a book that I've read in the last year and I've really found useful and I want to share it with you. So today's video I want to talk about this book here. It's called The Ripple Effect. It's written by Dr. Greg Wells and the subtitle here is Sleep Better, Eat Better, Move Better, and think better. And for me, this book caught my attention uh, for my, when I was in the bookstore for the first time in probably 10 years or so. Uh, a bookstore wasn't a place I frequented too often, but now it is. Uh, but this book caught my attention just because of the title and the subtitle. Anybody that knows me knows I love wellness and fitness and uh, athletic things. Um, and basically with that, um, I look at how they can tie into my everyday life and really kind of increase my productivity, increase my creativity. So this book fit me to a T. I have to say that uh, it's a really nice read and that's why I've gone out and bought a copy of it on my own to uh, give away. I did that as a giveaway uh, and I have my own copy. So I bought two and uh, for somebody that doesn't read a lot, hasn't read a lot I should say, now I do, uh, for them to buy the same book twice must say it's good. And uh, at the same time, uh, this book that I have, I'm going to be lending out to people and I'm definitely going to be reading it multiple times uh, over the next few years because I really like the scientific approach yet the practical approach that uh, the author took and kind of merged together, which is great for me with my science background. Um, so let's talk about the author for a second. He is uh, an exercise researcher, I believe, at the Toronto Sick Kids Hospital. He is also a professor of kinesiology at the University of Toronto. And he's also been as a, a, a consultant coach at uh, the national level here in Canada for many uh, different sports. So uh, he definitely knows what he's talking about. And the book starts out with an introduction. Um, there are a few chapters in the book. The first chapter is the introduction. And then he talks about how to sleep soundly, move more, eat smarter, think clearly. And the book wraps up talking about the seven pathways, which were one of the more interesting uh, pieces for me in this book at the very end of that. So I'll talk about that briefly at the end of this video, so stay tuned. And uh, if you look at the introduction, so the introduction to the book talks about uh, Greg Wells starting uh, an Ironman triathlon. If anybody knows what triathlons are, let alone Ironman triathlon, which are the pinnacle of endurance sports in my opinion, uh, you know that the people that do those are insane, they are super fit, um, and a lot of people would say that they're crazy. I race triathlon, so I can say that about myself. Um, but they're super fit and dedicated, and their mind is so focused on that task. And it takes months, like 8 to 10 to months to a year, uh, for people to train for Ironman triathlons uh, to get in the best shape of their life. So basically, that's where the book starts. And uh, Greg Wells talks about how he was on the starting line of an Ironman and all he could do is thinking about dying. And it's not the typical death of, oh, this is going to suck. I'm going to get killed by this race. It's going to be so hard. Um, but the fact that 12 months before he had been lying in a hospital bed uh, in the cardiac ward of a hospital. So kind of, kind of what changes had occurred in those 12 months to find himself going from a hospital to finishing an Ironman. Many people will never even consider. And the book goes on to talk about kind of if we were able to hack our sleep, hack our thinking, hack our moving, and hack our eating, then what's gonna happen there is we're gonna be able to increase our productivity, creativity, intelligence, and so many other things in the day-to-day -day life that we live. And let's talk about the name, the ripple effect, for a second here because it's an interesting name for sure. The ripple effect comes from the fact that if we were to make those small micro improvements, uh, what's going to happen is those 1% gains are going to add up over weeks, over months, over years, and then we're going to really see the huge long-term improvements. And I love the name, the ripple effect. It caught my attention in the bookstore, and I think it's perfect for this book. One of the best parts of this book for me personally was the fact that Dr. Greg Wells outlines the seven keys to sleeping soundly or the seven keys to moving more in every chapter of the book. This is really good for me because I was able to look at the keys and list them and then just kind of focus on doing those as I went through every chapter uh, and make sure that I was incorporating those things into my day-to-day -day life. 
So I'm going to give you a list here in this video, but I'd really recommend getting a copy of the book on your own because the book goes into way more detail and does a really good job of that. So the seven keys to sleeping soundly are save your caffeine for the morning, defend your last hour, which for me is a huge one, keep your sleep cave dark, be cool, sleep seven to eight hours each night, nap guilt-free, some of us are better at that than others, and wake up naturally, which is something I've focused on a lot and I really know that I'm doing well if I'm waking up naturally before my alarm goes off. The seven keys to moving more are build your fitness, build your strength, build your speed, and build your mobility, move in nature, which I am a huge proponent of. There's so many other benefits other than just the movement benefit when we get outside and we move in nature. Be a 24 hour athlete that talks about kind of before your workout, during your workout and after your workout, never stop kind of with that goal and that mindset of fitness and improving. And the last one, use it or lose it. The seven keys to eating smarter are hydrate, pretty important. Eat mostly plants, consume more nutrients, fewer calories, eat anti-inflammatory foods, and there's a lot of research that supports this now, eat healthy fats, eat healthy carbohydrates, and eat healthy proteins. So we can have fats, carbohydrates, and proteins, but just make sure that they're quality when you're consuming them. The seven keys to thinking clearly, use stress to your advantage, get into nature, practice yoga or Tai Chi, have perspective, which talks about the state of flow, which is a book that I'm excited to review uh, with you sometime. Focus relentlessly, use power words and self-talk to motivate yourself, which is huge, and meditate. And the last chapter in the book talks about using the seven pathways, using the ripple effect to live a world-class life. And I really like this because the book goes ahead and it shows you specifically, if you are kind of looking at the athletic uh, routine, what an actual schedule would be for you, okay? If you're a health advocate, if you're somebody that works in the health field, maybe wellness as well, it shows you the actual schedule and the keys to sleeping soundly, the keys to moving more, eating smarter, thinking clearly, etc. But it shows you a breakdown of a day in the life of kind of whatever your area is. So that's something that I really enjoyed looking at in this book. It told me kind of like, if I want to be considered a health advocate, what does my day look like? So I'm living it to the ripple effect standard. So that is the book, The Ripple Effect here, helping you sleep better, eat better, move better, and think better by Dr. Greg Wells. I'd highly recommend this book for yourself, for other people in your life. So if you want to get a copy of the book, go ahead and click the link down below to get yours. Let us know down in the comments below what part of the book you are most interested in. It's definitely uh, an exciting read and one that you're going to benefit from greatly. Whatever it costs, it's going to be worth way more in your real life changes. So if you like this video, please click the thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and follow us on Instagram for daily inspiration and encouragement you need to live a great life. You can also visit our website at www.greatnesseveryday.online. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.